What is up guys and girls? So this video is definitely a requested video. I've had so many people asking questions on the snake key and it's not spawning for them and they've done the battle and they've done all this. So what this video is, just a quick step-by-step -step tutorial on how to make sure that you'll get the phone call in the caravan and the head to spawn in the fridge. So I'm going to assume that you are familiar with the layout of this because you probably have been running around in circles. So after the initial margarita over here, you've killed her. What you want to do is head back up quickly. And this is also probably something you've done already, but I just want to go from the beginning. Now, what I did was open this up, and this is one of my first plays, and uh, the phone didn't ring. You have to read the note right there on the back. But I went over, tried to pick it up. For some reason, I always try to answer the phones, and they weren't fucking ringing. But anyway, read the note over there. The phone will ring. And after that phone call, we're going to head up to the lantern area to actually activate Marguerite. Activate her to take her lantern. So come over here, interact with this. Then we're going to go fight her. You can look at that doll as well if you want. I don't think it makes a difference. But then you'll come back here, and I don't actually show it. You can see the lantern there, because I'm trying to get past here. But she comes through, takes the lantern, and then you follow her. Fight. Win! Now one of the first mishaps is people forget to pick up the lantern after she dies. And it is something I did as well. So make sure you grab the lantern. From there, we're going to head all the way back to the door. Now I've kept this little section in because people said they were just getting completely turned around in this dark area. So I left this part in. Spread this up a little bit here. So go in, go straight ahead. And this is probably the most eeriest part of the game for me, definitely. Just, you know, the toys, the ball coming in there from the right. But you're going to head to the end, and there's no enemies at the moment, just falling dolls. Then you'll get to the door of her room, and a little cutscene will happen, but you go through. And then this is another mishap. People don't know there's a secret door here. You don't have to push X, just walk into it. Grab the arm. The D series arm. Very strange ingredients for a serum, I must say. Anyway, from here we're going to head all the way back to our caravan. And at this point, the phone should ring. If it doesn't, then you're not playing Resident Evil 7. Now, where the hell are you? Look in the fridge. Just like he said. So, to your right, as you know, there's going to be a fridge. Open the fridge, there's going to be the head of the cop. Sorry, deputy. And on the back of it is going to be pinned a note. You can actually hear the sound effect of it being actually a key of some sort. And I hadn't heard that before until I watched this again. Anyway, we're going to head all the way down to the dissection room. And that's where you fought Jack. And you should come across the deputy. The headless deputy. Then you can grab your snake key. So yeah, that's that guys. I hope that clears it up and now I can just paste a link when people ask this question. So I hope you found it informative and I hope you solved your snake key issue. And please remember to like if you like and subscribe if you really like. And I'll see you next time.